speed of light, the cloud of dust, and a hearty hi Silver, the Lone Ranger. With his faithful Indian companion, Tonto, the masked rider of the plains led the fight for law and order in the early western United States. The stories of his strength and courage, his daring and resourcefulness have come down to us through the generations. And nowhere in the pages of history can one find a greater champion of justice. Return with us now to those thrilling days of yesteryear. From out of the past come the thundering hoofbeats of the great horse, Silver. The Lone Ranger rides again. Come on, Silver! Faster, boy, faster! I'll silver! Fire! Tonto was in the Pine Flats General Store with Dan Reed, the Lone Ranger's 14-year-old nephew. The man behind the counter referred to a long list of items as he filled the order, piling the articles on the counter. Meanwhile, Dan Reed observed... Tonto, I don't understand this. You, not savvy what? Well, you're laying in a mighty big stock of food. But well, it must be about enough to last us all the rest of the trip to Texas. Lone Ranger say we get plenty food. I know it. He make long lists. Well, I know that, too. But the Lone Ranger's always thought it was wise to travel as lightly as possible. Well, that's right. Well, there are at least two places between here and Texas where we could get supplies. That's right. We not go straight to Texas, Dan. Oh. Other business come first. Golly, I wondered about that. Does anyone suspect the Lone Rangers around this part of the country? Maybe. There's been a man standing on the porch ever since we came into this door. He's kept a sharp watch on us. Plenty of people curious when Indian buy long list of food. Did you notice that fellow? Uh, me see him. Me keep sharp watch on him, too. Well, I didn't see a look at him at all. I didn't think you noticed him. You look in back of storm. You see mirror glass there? Oh, sure enough. Keep watching the reflection. I see. Well, I reckon that'll fill the bill. Yeah. Uh, how much? Well, there's a total right down there. I figured it up three times. Make sure it was right. Uh, well, here. Here, cash. Hey, hey, wait a minute. Well, don't bend, I guess you're all right. Yeah, you must be figuring on taking a downright long trip. Maybe long time before you buy more food. Hey, which way you going? Maybe go plenty different way. Hey, who's your kid? Uh, him, friend. We go now, Dan. You don't hang to give out much information, do you? You take that bundle, Dan. Yep. Let me take this one. Hey, look here, Engine. If you don't want to tell true facts, just say so. I'll not. take over. Oh. Huh? Hey, let go of me. Not so fast, kid. Now, see now, here. Take it easy, kid. This is Mr. Sneed. I only want to ask a couple of questions, that's all. Take hand off boy's arm. Redskins talk different when they talk to me. Take hand off boy's arm. Is that a threat? Oh. Well, all right, then. You needn't look like you was about to knife me. Only wanted to ask something that's mighty important. Well, you ask. I've heard that a masked man was seen near Pine Flats this morning. 
Now, is there any chance that you two are his pals? That's none of your business. Then... No. Why, you ask? Well, look here. If your name happens to be Tonto, I've got some downright important information for you. Maybe me see someone, me tell him. All right, then. If you should just happen to see a masked man riding a white horse, and if it should just happen that this hombre is the man that's called a Lone Ranger... A Lone Ranger? Doggone, I've heard of him. It might be that he's interested in the Forbidden Plains. If so, I could help him out considerable. What are the Forbidden Plains? A good place to stay away from. A doggone good place to stay away from if you like to stay healthy. How you help out? Well, I happen to know considerable about those planes. That's all I got to say. If this Lone Ranger wants me to help, I'd be downright glad to do so. There's a tough pack of two-legged wolves that make their headquarters in the Forbidden Plains. They've done me no end of harm. I'd like to see him cleaned out. Well, if me see Lone Ranger, me tell him. I reckon anyone in town can tell you where Jim Sneed lives. The Sneed Ranch is one of the biggest. I'm home most of the time. That's all. Uh, you come, Dan. We go now. Hey, wait a minute. We go now. Hey, wait. It's all fired important you listen to me. Well, you speak. Well, I don't know if you're the friends of the Lone Ranger. But if you are, I... Who is six alive? What matter? Well, there ain't no arguing the point that the planes need to be rid of them rats and snakes, but I would want to see the Lone Ranger killed and try on that same. I never heard of the Forbidden Plains. Son, they're badlands. Somehow or other, that stretch of country between the Gap and the river was left out when they made up the states. It's really a place that no state controls, so there's no law there. It's a hiding place for every cutthroat in this part of the country. Oh. It's fertile land. Fine grazing, good water, everything. But an honest man can't live there. It's for outlaws. They kill off each other for a time, and they all organize into one big band. They come out and rob and kill, and then go back with their loot. Take an old man's advice. Don't go there. Don't do it. Don't let the Lone Ranger go there. It's certain death. Lone Ranger was camped in the woods outside the town of Pine Flats. He rose from beside the fire as Tonto arrived at sunset. Tonto, where's Dan? Him stay back. Watch trail. For what? Follow in town. Know you nearby. Is that so? Now we come back here in roundabout way. Make sure no one follows. Oh? Dan stay back at Tonto. Watch at Edge of Woods. Make sure no one follow. Who knows I'm nearby? Fellow named Sneed. Him big rancher. Him tell about Forbidden Plain. Sneed. I've heard the name. Ah. Him offer help. Say him no, Forbidden Plain. Go with you. Help catch crook. I see. Him plenty curious. Ask plenty question. Hello. I've learned that there are at least a dozen outlaws banded together in one group. Ah. That's what Sneed say. They made a lot of raids on the people around here. They've also stopped a few stage coaches and one railroad train. There's no way to arrest them while they stay on the Forbidden Plain. Ah. Let me help unload those supplies. <laughs> you get plenty big list of supplies. How long you plan to stay in Badland? No longer than is absolutely necessary, Tonto. Uh, here, flour sack. Thanks, Kimasabi. Steady, Scout. Now, what about the gunpowder? Uh, here, here, small can. Good. And here, salt. Here, bacon. Did you get everything that was on the list? Uh, me get them. Good enough. Now then, Tonto... I want the man named Sneed. Ah, let me show you where Sneed live. No, I don't want to go there. I want you to bring him here. Oh. More than that, Kimosabe. I want you to do a lot of other things for me. I'm going to drop out of sight. Oh, where you go? I'll tell you later. You not stay here? You'll have to take care of Mr. Sneed yourself. You'll also have to give Dan his instructions. Now pay very close attention to what I tell you. Tonto listened attentively to the instructions, then left the camp and met Dan Reed. Ho, oh, Scott, ho, oh, fella, ho, oh, oh, fella, ho. Oh. Rain up, Dan. Ho oh, there, ho, oh, boy. Ho. Oh. Uh, he wants to speak to you. Is there anything wrong? I was going on to camp. Moon Ranger, make plans. You've got job to do. I have? Oh, golly, that's swell. What is it, Tonto? You go back to town. Yeah? You stay at Feller in store. Tell him Lone Ranger want you stay there. Stay there? 
But what can I do while I'm with a storekeeper? How'll that help? I'll me not know. Lone Ranger make plan. Oh, he wants me out of danger. That's the angle. He wants me to stay with a storekeeper while he goes after those crooks in Forbidden Plains. Isn't that it? Lone Ranger make plans, Dan. And me tell you, you go to store. Tell him you stay there. Uh, all right, orders are orders. But I'll be mighty glad when I can be of some use to you and the Lone Ranger. <laughs> There's plenty of time ahead. Oh, look, Tonto, when my dad was my age, I'll bet he was able to ride and shoot and do things. Uh, and... There's plenty of time ahead. You go now. Me got job to do. Where you going? Uh, me go get Sneed. Take him to Lone Ranger camp. Sneed? That man we saw in the store. That's right. Get him up, scout! Doggone it. I'll be glad when I can be of some help to him. Get up there, boy. Get up. Tonto headed for Sneed's ranch, ready to carry out the masked man's orders to the letter, no matter how Sneed might object. After inquiry, he found the rancher in a saddle shed. Hey, Juniper, it's a redskin again. What are you doing here? Uh, you give me message. Yeah? Me take message to mask man. The Lone Ranger? Uh. So you are his friend. Him want you. Yeah? Him say you go to camp with Tonto. You be in Tonto. That's right. Well, let me see. Wants me to help him? That right. When? You come now. Well, I don't know about that. Maybe I could. I'd plan to do some things here, but I can set him aside. I'd sure be glad to help that Lone Ranger clean out the crooks in the Forbidden Plain. How does he plan to get at him? He not know yet. He can't get the law to help him. He knows that, don't he? Uh -huh. The law don't have a thing to say on the Forbidden Plain. Unless he can get the crooks to come here, he won't have a chance. You come now? Maybe he plans to go in there gunning. Just shoot it out with him and clean him out that way. Is that his scheme? Him not know where gang hide in plain. Are you sure he don't know the hiding place? Maybe he knows it and didn't tell you. Him not know it. What is the plan he's aiming to use? Me not know. But he wants me to go to the camp with you. He wants me to line up alongside him and shoot it out with the toughest pack of killers in these parts. You go camp now. Well, all right. Maybe he'll tell me his plan when we get there. Eh? Oh, what'd you want, Hendricks? Mr. Sneed, I gotta speak to you. Well, speak up. What is it, Hendricks? Is there anything wrong in the bunkhouse? What's wrong's here. Meaning what? Night's coming on, boss, and the night air ain't healthy. What? I wouldn't take too much of it if I was you. You never can tell what might come up out of the dark. See here, when I want advice, Hendricks, I'll go to someone more in a cow hand that works for me. Maybe the boys wouldn't like for you to get too chummy with a lone ranger. If uh, you know what I mean. The boys? Hendricks, you I wouldn't them... go out in the night air, boss. Well, maybe you're right. You come with Tonta now. Engine, you get... need come with Tonta now. I said you... I... Hey, Tonto, you knocked my toughest ranch hand down. You better vamoose hand fast. I won't be able to keep him from killing you. Me go and you go too. You come on. Let go of me. Hey, you me. come at Lone Ranger order. No, let go. We both go. Sneed, you're heading for trouble. Get him up, scout. Let go. Why are you? Get him up, scout. I missed. Uh, Sneed don't know what he's asked for. Stand still. We got some hard riding to do. Now, get! The curtain falls on the first act of our Lone Ranger story. Before the next exciting scenes, please permit us to pause for just a few moments.
to continue our story. Tonto carried Sneed to the Lone Ranger's camp. It was after dark when the two arrived, and Tonto dismounted from his powerful paint horse. Where are we? Why'd you bring me here? I won't help. I... You get down now. Get me a horse. Let me leave here. You leave by and by. Where's that Lone Ranger? Let me talk to him. I won't help you now. You practically kidnapped me. Lone Ranger, not here. Well, not here? Then where is he? Maybe you see him by and by. Not now. Uh, who's that feller who shoot at us? Hendricks? I never knew it till tonight, but he must be working with a gang in the plane. You heard what he told me. Uh, me hear him. I'll be killed if I help you and the Lone Ranger. Ah. Uh. Loan, loan me a horse. Let me get away from here. Pretty soon we both leave. Me look over camp first. I'm not going over the boundary. I'll not set foot on the forbidden uh, plane. Maybe you afraid your friend shoot you. What do you mean? Your friend. Outlaw. They're not my friends. Uh, we see by and by. You know where Outlaw hides. Oh, yes, but... And Henrik's know that. Well, I didn't know he was one of the gang. I might have realized it. suppose the gang does have men working in town to keep posted in what happens, but I didn't suspect it. I told Hendricks a lot of things I knew about the gang's hideout. How you know where gang hide? Well, I've lived around here a long time. I knew that country before the outlaws took over. There's only one place where they could hide. Listen, suppose I draw a map and show you how to get to the gang's hideout. How'd that be? Ah, you do that. Me build up fire for light, and you draw a map. While Tonto kept Sneed occupied, Dan examined the little room on the second floor of the general store where the storekeeper had told him he could stay. The Lone Ranger's nephew was about to blow out the candle when he heard... Yeah? Dan, are you awake? Oh, yes, sir. You mind if I step inside? Not at all. I've come right in. I was just about to blow out my light. Uh, I want to have a little talk with you, lad. Yes, sir. I understand that you're a friend of the Lone Ranger. Is that the truth? Oh, you bet it's the truth. Well, I told you he's the one that sent me here. He figured you'd be safe here, eh? Well, I suppose so. Did he figure there'd be danger where he was? Well, I don't know. He's uh, aiming to catch the outlaws on the Forbidden Plains, ain't he? Well, I don't know what his plans are. You don't? No, sir, he didn't tell me. He must have had plans of some sort. Don't he usually tell you what he's going to do? Well, not always. But if he does anything that's not especially dangerous, he takes you with him, don't he? I'm generally with him. I see. Hmm? Is something wrong? Well, Dan, a little while ago, a desert rat came by and begged a place to sleep. Oh? I told him he could bunk in the woodshed back of the store. Then he told me a few things. Yes, sir? Maybe I should pass him on to you in case you can get word to the Lone Ranger. But how can I find him? I wish I knew if you was telling me the truth. Well, I never lie. All right, all right. You needn't get so huffy about it. Did the uh, Lone Ranger say anything when he got the goods you and the Indian bought from me? Well, I wasn't there when he got the goods. Not there? No, sir. Say, what did that desert rat tell you? Well, he told me things that you should hear. But I'm hanged if I'll tell you. If you don't tell me anything... But I don't know anything. Hey, storekeeper. Lem, where are you? In here. What's up, Hendricks? Who's a kid? Friend of the Lone Ranger's. Why? Oh, he is, huh? Well, listen, the Lone Ranger's gonna make trouble. He had that redskin friend of his make off with Sneed. Yeah? Yeah, and Sneed knows a hideout. What of it? Sneed can be made to show where it is. And I've got later news than that. Listen, Hendricks, the Lone Ranger is working to get me. You? You? A desert rat told me. The Lone Ranger suspected a lot of the stuff that was stolen from the Express would be sold right here in my store. He had this kid in the Indian buy up a lot of goods. So, that's it. He's not interested in the gang. He wants the head man. Me. You. You were just acting like a stork. That's right. Now shut up. Yeah, but Lamb, this kid's a... Yes, the kid's a friend of the Lone Ranger. But when we're done, the Lone Ranger won't be making trouble. I'm getting out of here. Get back there. You can't keep me here. The window. I got him. Let me go. You can't hold me. Let me go. Do you hear? Uh, here's some ropes. Tie him up. Uh, he's a fighting fool. Uh, help me rope him. Yeah. Uh, now. Uh, I got him. I don't want him hurt yet. He's my trump card if the Lone Ranger gets too close. Help. Come in. Help me. Well, so you finally decided to rope that youngster, huh? Come on in, Larson. 
I didn't know you were here. They sent for Larson and the rest. They're coming in to get their orders. Oh, so this is another one of your murder gang. My, 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 but ain't he the spunky young squirt. So this is a friend of the Lone Ranger, huh? Why, you little coyote. Take your breath, Larson. We got a lot of work. What are the plans, boss? The Lone Ranger suspects me. How'd he do that? He found my store was stocked with goods. It was stolen. Well, how'd he know it? He found some of the stolen goods north of here. Asked the pilgrims where they got them. I told you to be careful who you sold them things to. If you'd been as careful about the way you sold your part of the stuff as you make us be in the selling of the cattle, the Lone Ranger would never Save have found it. out about this. Who are you talking about that now? we got to work fast. There's two things to do. First, get all the stolen stuff out of my store in case the Lone Ranger sends a law here to search me. Well, the boys will be here to take care of that. The second is to locate the Lone Ranger. If he's hard to handle, remind them we got his young friend here who could be killed in a variety of ways. Bring the Lone Ranger here. I got his killer all picked out. Huh? Who? A desert rat that's asleep in my woodshed. We'll frame him for anything we do. You'll never get the Lone Ranger. You shut your trap or I'll shut it for you. You haven't got anybody around but our own men, have you? Yeah, just our own boys and the critter in the woodshed. Well, the rest of the gang will be here soon. Then we'll get the goods out of your store. Then we'll get the Lone Ranger. I know how we can find him. Through Sneed. Sneed will lead him to the cave hideout. We'll trap him there. Good enough. Now wait here. I'll check up with the breed. What's he doing? He's guarding that desert red. Larson, you and Hendrix stay here till the rest come. The storekeeper went down the stairs, then through his darkened store to the rear, where a half-breed sat next to an open door. Well, Breed, is everything all right? Si, senor. It's all right so far. How about him? <laughs> Amigo... He is very grateful for drink I give him. You saw him drink it all? Oh, it is dark. I make no light. But he give me back cup and ask for more. I give it to him. Uh, he sleep very tight. Good enough. I'm going to need him. He'll be a downright handy critter to have. When he's found dead with an empty gun, I'll say I shot him because he shot the Lone Ranger, Savvy? <laughs> that is good. Bueno. Stay right here now. I'll let you know when you want it. Stop, bueno. I will do so. Maybe I find money in Hombre's pocket. Soon I take a look. When I'm sure he sleeps, I do not move. <laughs> you not make sound. Tonto, reaching from in back of the breed, clamped a hand across his mouth and an arm about his neck. In scant seconds, the crook was gagged and roped effectively and carried to a corner of the room. Oh, you stay there. You make move, me throw knife. Now me go to woodshed. Tonto went into the dirty, dark woodshed, his moccasined feet making no sound as he crossed the dirt floor. He crouched beside a pile of straw in the corner. Ah, me come. Keep very quiet. I'm getting out of the old clothes now. Did you bring my own things? Uh Uh-huh. Everything here. Here. Boots. Good. Not old. Tonight is a showdown. Uh Uh-huh. What about Dan? Oh, him safe. But gang get rough plenty soon. They won't have time to harm him now. My shirt. Uh Uh-huh. Your shirt. Careful when you handle the guns. Don't make a sound. These crooks are on every side. Uh Uh-huh. Here, gun belt. I'm going to slip out the rear door. Silver's right outside, isn't he? Ah, uh, him there. Him waiting. Good. You know your part, don't you? Ah, uh, me know. And me ready. Here. Hand. Mask. Thanks. Right, I'm ready. You wait here until you get the signal. If someone comes in, you'll have to lie on the bunk and hope they don't know I've gone. Adios, Kimosabe. <laughs> While Dan Reed lay on the bunk, tightly tied, Hendrick stood guard and kept a running account of what went on. <laughs> now they're hauling the cases of goods out of the store. They're loading it on two wagons out on the side. They won't get away with anything. No. <laughs> Don't you wish that was the case? Yeah, well, Lone Ranger will be here. Kid, the Lone Ranger's a long ways from here now. 
Sneed has just about now been persuaded to show him where the hideout is. <laughs> it's a doggone good thing the boss ought to have some of us around here to keep a watch on things. <laughs> Otherwise, we wouldn't have known Sneed was ready to blast. Well, let me look out the window. Stay where you are. I'll do all the looking. Oh, but I hear horse. Shut up. Someone's coming. Half a dozen riders. Maybe new members of the gang. It's, I bet... <laughs> it's the law. It's the Lone Ranger. Surround the place. Shoot to kill if you have to. Grab those horses. Don't let them get away with the evidence. He brought the lawman. He had it all worked out. That dumb fool, Lem. Tricked you into bringing all the men from the plane. There's plenty of law here. I'll deal with you. Then I'll get down and join the fight. But first, I'll get the Lone Ranger from this window. No, no. Look out! The window up here! Look out! Let me get him. Toto, stop him! Uh, get you! you. Oh, that's it, Toto. You hit him like a battering ram. Uh, let me get you loose now. Cut rope and jiffy. Toto, the storekeeper's the head man. Uh, Lone Ranger suspected him. And there's an old desert rat around here that... No, they're an old desert rat. Lone Ranger come here in disguise. Keep watch. So that was it. The Lone Ranger was the desert rat. Hurry, my legs now. Get that rope. Uh, he keeps Sneed busy. Gang thinks Sneed lead way to hide out. Lone Ranger, long way off. Up, don't shoot. My hands are up. Get broken on those cooks, boys. I guess the charge is enough against every one of them, except the storekeeper. And we've two wagon loads of evidence against him. Marshal, I found a half-breed tied up inside. He's one of them. I guess that finishes the job. A lot of men will find their stolen cattle in the Forbidden Plain. Forbidden no longer. The Lone Ranger cleaned it up. Um, Marshal. Uh, Tonto. Another feller upstairs. <laughs> Tonto knocked him out and then tied him. You may have to carry that critter. Tonto sure smacked him. Uh, here, Dan. Here, horses. Oh, good. Uh, where's the lone ranger? I want to express the gratitude on, of the ranch. Come on, Tonto. Now we're heading south. Uh, there, lone ranger. Steady, boy. Get up there, boy. Get him up, scout. I will still just heard is a copyrighted feature of the Lone Ranger Incorporated. 